early on. To settle down to race, Zonke is the early leader. Joy to Joy is trying to overcome the draw, and Joy to Joy is run up into second. Attitude on the outside. Lady Elbar is near the rail. Eternal Blossoms. White Rose is in the blue silks back in that sixth position, only four lengths off the lead. Path to Glory, Willow Grange, then Maximum Refund. Silver Causeway is further back, then Spanish Lady, and then back at the end of the field is dressed for success. A move to the 900 metre mark, and now Zonke leads it. Lady Elbar is second, Joy to Joy, the green season cap gets niggled at. The attitude's on the outside, and White Rose is back fifth in the blue, three and a half lengths off the lead. Then Willow Grange, Eternal Blossoms and Path to Glory. Silver Causeway is on the move. Further back is Maximum Refund and then Dress for Success. Now to turn into the home stretch and Zonke brings him in. The Attitude second. Lady Elba on the inside. Willow Grange, Joy to Joy and uh, White Rose is going to go through between runners now. Getting to the 300, Zonke, Lady Elba and White Rose just needs a split. And here comes White Rose with a good looking run. And White Rose hits the front at the 200 attitude. Willow Grange on the inside of that one, path to glory. But White Rose is going on and White Rose is going to score. Matter of what will run second. So White Rose has won it. The second position is going to go to path to glory. Close for third, Willow Grange, attitude. Number 12, White Rose, the third favourite at 150, the dynasty for the Cartsons. This one also bred by W.J. Engelbrecht Jr., also bred the first race winner, uh, Gimme the Money. And this one wins it well, White Rose, Stuart Randolph, third time at the track, and they win it well, going 1,600 metres for the first time. Path to Glory, number nine, runs into second at 5.30, the place. Third place, La Attitude and Willow Grange. Very close. We'll leave that to the judges between third and fourth. Further back is Zonke and then came Lady Elbaham. A well-detached field at the business end. And then Maximum Refund. Toad favourite, the winner at 12.50. And then Joy to Joy and followed by Dress for Success. And then came Silver Causeway and further back in the run, Spanish Lady. We'll take a look at that head-on shortly. See the cameraman also having a difficult time to try and keep this camera steady. It is an absolute howling tailwind. And here's the favourite, White Rose, number 12, Victorious, under Stuart Randolph, until the third, back to the studio. As the trees and the branches start to come down in the parade ring, White Rose has left it on the track and this daughter of Dynasty, she looked to be the right horse but at the gate just seemed to be that half a length slow which could have cost her. Yeah, I was a little bit worried because I saw as I think it was only seconds with the horses to come out, I see it move back and then I saw that and uh, I was, I know uh, Stu Rondoff and I know he's going to do the good job, you know. He had to be brave at the 300, the gap looked to be tight, he went through? Yeah, uh, but I was... Like I said, I was not really worried because I know Stu Randolph, uh, you know, the fellow at work, you know. I think it's just going to be a nice fellow. Still a baby, eh? Only third run, you know? Yeah. Now you've got Allman and Yellow Submarine. Allman, I believe, has had a little bit of a break. Yeah, Allman just do have a chance, you know. We chat to Stu Randolph and then uh, you know what to do, you know. Yeah. Um, I said good luck to Stu for now. Uh, good luck to Mr. Kutzin. Um, I'd like to say good luck uh, to the owners, uh, Mr. Bayer, Mrs., uh, Mr. Mins, and uh, Mrs. Jeffy. Yeah. Uh, good luck to Stu Rondoff, who does a great job, you know. Well done, enjoy the moment. Thank you. Thank you very much, my brother. Let's get Stuart Randolph into the picture, the blue silks with the green spots. And I just touched on that start. She seemed to just hesitate to hoffily. Yeah, she was a bit nervous in the gates, but I think this wind was stirring her up a bit. So it wasn't too detrimental. I was able just to cover up, which I wanted. And it worked out nicely. More of a concern. You had a lot of horse under you, and the gap looked to be just getting a bit tight. Yeah, I got a bit closer, but I knew she should be able to accelerate through them once, once I asked her for an effort. And she did. She responded very well. 
Well, a brave ride from you and a brave performance from the Philly, so well done. No, absolutely. Yeah, a big thank you to Lunga and, and Glenn and the team and uh, well done to the winning connections. So, Congratulations. Thanks very much. Thanks very much to Stuart Randolph. He's produced on number 12, White Rose. She's let rip. She's come through. Number nine, Path to Glory, two and one, rounding up trifectas and quartets. That's a wrap for race number two. Thank you.